We're still tracking this storm dealing with uh, dropping a lot of rainfall over the coast of Texas now, and that's going to be a problem. I'm thinking mainly for the Houston areas before things really start to calm down here. And as you were mentioning, Keenan, we have a lot of rainfall to get through, not only in this zone, but potentially more storms that we'll be tracking as well since we're uh, just past the peak of hurricane season. Just looking at Texas right now from Bay City to Houston, this is a slow moving tropical storm. Uh, as of the 2 a.m. update from the National Hurricane Center, it's a weaker tropical storm, winds at 40 miles per hour. It's going to continue to weaken, but based on how slowly it's moving, it's also going to be able to drop a lot of rainfall in this zone. Uh, just looking at the rolling rainfall totals here, it could pick up close to five to seven inches of rain widespread. And those purple colors you see there, that's nearly a foot of rain or more that could fall in that zone. Back at home, we're still dry. We're in a dry stretch right now, 50 degrees. Uh, the dew point is pretty close to the actual temperature. Winds are calm, so a lot like yesterday morning, uh, visibility is dropping in some spots. The true definition of patchy, uh, we have some fog development around Port Huron and also down towards Ann Arbor. And right now, it looks like that's where it's most dense or along 94 near Saline as well as Northfield and Ann Arbor near US 23. And this is going to stay pretty dense in some spots until the sun really gets going. Temperatures at around 39 over in Ann Arbor, so the temperature really dropped. Pontiac at 48, Lapeer 43, Monroe at 40, and Windsor at 46 degrees. We have a little bit of fog passing through, or I should say smoke passing through the upper atmosphere that's crossing over the state. So there could be some hazy sunshine for today. But still a nice day. We'll have temperatures near the 50s across much of Metro Detroit. 75 will be the high temp. Sunny skies with some haze trying to sneak through, so maybe some veiled sunshine. And as we get to the evening, it's going to be around 63 degrees. Skies are going to stay clear. We'll cool down, not nearly as cool as this morning's going to be at 54. And the seven day forecast has an 80 degree day. That's going to be on Wednesday. So we bring fall in today, but it's going to kick things off with a summertime feel all the way towards the weekend where rain returns as we get towards Sunday into next Monday.